Marcano, left handed batter. And the first pitch is taken for a strike. Umpires will widen the zone. I sure hope so. No, I'm though. With you. The answer is no, probably. I mean, uh, you still have to go about it the same way. But they are humans. They probably don't want to be back there in 94. That feels like home runs and has driven in five. The 2 1 pitch taken high, and it's 3 and 1. It put outs away from tying Pudge Rodriguez. 14,000 in front of the plate. He's all a part of that. The 3 2. And that's it out of play. That is a, a whole lot of this game for like 10 years. And then to be able to do what Yachty's doing behind the plate. Lined into center. And the catch is made by Bader. And a Braves with 10 hits. And the first pitch to him. Fouled back. And that's strike one. Yeah, yes, they hope they want to be able to build around him. He's 11 for his last 19. And he pulls it fouled. Nothing in two early on is falling behind in counts. That's where you have to be in the middle of the zone. And we've seen a little bit of that. We saw that in the cup. And the one two pitch to Reynolds lined on a hanging breaking ball into center. Man could hit. He's a good player and like you all players as I can around my young club. Here's key Brian Hayes. Libertor was asked what he learned. Oh, it does. It, it, well, and the throw stuff down the middle. That was the Reynolds hit right there. It was a curved ball. It was center cut. There's honest over there. And the 1 1 pitch popped up right side. And that'll find the seats and out of play. As far as their job's concerned, here's a 1 2 pitch and a strikeout of Key Brian Hayes. Now, if he gave some the option to be home in the AC and have a Six home runs and he's driven in 22. Swing and a miss. He's got a little extra jump on this. Yeah, and I, for me, it was the confidence with the fastball, or at least it perceived confidence. And the 0 2 pitch on its way. Popped up on the infield. Coming in, Nolan Gorman, childhood buddy, puts it away. He and Liberator the best. It's the best he's felt since 2019. So the decision has been made. To start Jack tomorrow. Flaherty told me having the same guys that have been around me day after day throughout this process seems like a better. All I can do is execute pitch after pitch until Ali comes out and says, You're done. But Jack is back. It's clear that was the idea. If he would make another rehab assignment, this is Diego uh, Castillo. This ball was free and easy coming out of his hand. The slider was diving in. We were just talking about JT Brubaker's slider and how he was tying up lefties. Well, that's exactly what Jacks looked like. 215, the average with the eight home runs leads the rookies in homers with the eight. Go and Sawinski, a Chicago native, coming back to the Pirates. And they had two of those guys in their lineup. And the 1 1 pitch taken high. Just saw a shot there of Derek Shelton. It's an Egyptian dog. Yeah, they're really quick. Like, kind of like a whippet. Is that right? Probably. I would liken it to a whippet. Info from Brad today. And the 3 1 pitch. Ground ball right side, base hit. And Castillo will stop at second base. And the first. Here's Yu Chang. Good play by Yachty to keep that in front. Chang with one of the best plays we have seen from a second baseman this year as he right at the base. But Chang, he was all over. This one ended up being off Keller. He makes the play. Ultimately made a nice play. That's a good play right there. That's exactly what the doctor ordered for Matthew Libertor. A little 6-4-3. Cardinals turned four behind Dakota Hudson in the ball game on Sunday in four innings. The bag at third off the line. And the 1-0 pitch. One ball and one strike. It's a good tight slider right there by Matthew Libertor. We're used to seeing the big breaking ball, but to those lefties, that sweep. And that's strike two. And over there at third. Let it rip. Two and two.
And the next is swung on and missed and strikeout number two. Originally selected by Pittsburgh in the fourth round. 118 overall. Out of the powerhouse. Van He's hitting 250 at Indianapolis this year. And I wonder. No. No, I wouldn't. But I like it. Would you think about clearly? That's a pretty name. Very much so. Popped up to the right side. Pujols is over, and that drops foul. It just, it's something to think about. He rain in the uh, other side and say, well, you know, we, we promised that we were going to go with you and chew on. 2-2, two, two, foul back. Of Cal Mitchell. I want to see him settle in now. Maybe flight. 3-2 pitch. Mind foul and out of play. Throw him a fastball away. Make him earn it. And the 3-2, and he walked him. Second walk issued by Matthew Liberator. Here's Marcano lined out to center. First time up. And that's a souvenir here at the ballpark. Well, as we mentioned a second ago, Matthew Liberator was able to walk or work around. And the 0-1 pitch gets away from Yachty, and that'll go to the backstop. Cardinals turned a double play back in the second that allowed Libertor to get out of trouble. He walked the first third inning. Runner at second, shift on the right side in the 1-1. Really took something off that breaking ball, and it's 1-2. And, and a line drive out to left field. Catch made. First pitch is hit out of play. One two pitch and the 0 1 by Matthew Liberator. Couldn't hold up. Just got a piece and it's nothing in two. Oh, the plate miss in off. The 0 2. Ooh, just missed on the inside corner. It's a great spot. It's a great spot right there. You're trying to go in there. That strike many times on the inside corner like that. The one-two pitch is swung on and missed. And a strikeout, number three for Matthew Libertor. And two outs, runner at second base. And a high pop-up on the infield. It'll be Sosa, and he's got it. Pirates have stranded three. We're midway through three, and the top of the lineup is coming up. Well, Libertor through three innings. Every inning has been 18 pitches in the inning. And that is pitch number 55. Chavis popped out to second baseman Nolan Gorman first time up, and that swung on and missed. Now, love June. We talked about it the other day, too, Brad. He loves facing the Pirates. He's got 12 home runs in that span. Wow. Swing and a miss and strikeout number four. Another relationship with him over the last couple of years. Out to center. Well hit. Bader back and makes the catch off the bat of Castillo. Harrison makes that look easy, by the way. He doesn't care about streaks. He doesn't care about any of that stuff. That's not normal. Like, guys generally are, oh, yeah, no, I've got felt. Well, and this game is all about numbers, right? And that's how you're paid. So that's something to think about as well is liberatory struck history of baseball and the 0 2. So he's been a part of four today. Find the plate with Yachty and the 1 2 pitch it out of play. Even fight over the years to be in all these games. Nice slider off the plate right there. I like that selection. I think you can elevate one of them. The 2 2. And he struck him out. And there it is. Put out. 6 4 2 5 4 2 on the put out. He will make his return from a shoulder issue. He will start for the Cardinals against the Pirates. I'm with John Mazalock. And John, Flaherty thought 
that maybe he'd get a third, but instead he will pitch with you guys up here. Can you go through the thought process with us? Yeah, the volume, but the, the part that's really going to be the test is intensity. And so what we want to see happen, and, and what he really felt like was he can't replicate intensity down in the minor leagues. He could keep doing the volume, but he felt that as well, and he, he does feel the continuity of care here makes more sense for him. And so, you know, look, we, as, as we all know, we're look smart about this. We don't want any, any setbacks. We don't want to have to have to revisit uh, uh, the IL with him. So I think, you know, Olchin, again, um, we're hopeful that that will address his situation. And if so, you know, we're, we're hopeful that uh, he can begin his throwing program and, and be back in, in due time. But thanks, Jim. Danny, so some guys making progress, and Jack is back. All right, looking forward to it. Thank you, Jimmy. This is Jason DeLay. He's made his Major League debut here today. But there was a play again. I'm going to reference. That. And uh, I said to Ali, I go, was he running not to slide? There was something wrong with his leg? I mean, what's, what's the idea behind that? He said, oh, no, no, no. Completely by design, and let me walk you through it. And then he walked me through about five other issues uh -huh. of one run ball games can you steal one here or there we talk about details and defense and positioning oftentimes that's next level edge of the track and the catch made by Tyler O'Neill off the bat of delay here this season it's a continuation play and you keep going so that's the out so the run bad there's gonna be people watching this game saying that is something we have not done worked at or thought of boys huddle up yep we're doing something early work And the 1-1 one, one. lined out to deep left. O'Neal going back, and he'll make the catch on the run. 